What's up guys and welcome to Web Predications Daily Tech Tips. In today's tech tip, we're learning how to use FaceTime on Android. Now you might have heard that with iOS 15 and iPadOS 15, you can now use FaceTime on Android. But then you might be wondering, why does using FaceTime on Android involve iPadOS 15 and iOS 15? Well, that's because you're not gonna go to the Android Play Store and install the FaceTime app. All the FaceTime calls have to be initiated from an Apple device that has iOS 15 or iPadOS 15. But then Apple has extended FaceTime that you can now chat and video conference and video call with someone who's not necessarily on an Apple device. That means you can start your FaceTime call from an iPhone or an iPad using iOS 15 or iPadOS 15 respectively and you can extend that call to any other device including Android devices and Windows devices. So in this video I'll be showing you how to specifically receive a FaceTime call on your Android device. Alright so here we have an Apple device this is the iPhone 10s Max running iOS 15 and then here we have the Samsung Galaxy A32. Samsung's don't get any more Android than that. So like I said, the call has to be initiated from an Apple device. So I'm gonna go into FaceTime and with iOS 15, this is what FaceTime looks like. You can create a new FaceTime call right here, but then you can also create a link by tapping on create link. And that will create a link and allow you to share the link through messaging, WhatsApp, any messaging services that you can use to share the link. So I'm gonna choose WhatsApp. And then I'll send this link to my work phone, which is this phone, which is my Android device. Select that, tap on next. And this is what the link looks like. So I'm just gonna send that link over to the Android device. Now, having sent the link, that call will now go to the upcoming section of calls. It means it's a pending uh, FaceTime call. I haven't joined and neither has the person on the Android device joined. Now I'm gonna go to the Android device, get that notification, here it is. So this is the first time invite I got. Now I'm gonna copy this link because if I try to open it, it's gonna open using an unsupported browser. Now for these calls to work, you do need to use a supported browser. And one of those supported browsers is of course, Google Chrome on your Android device. So I'm gonna go to Chrome. So on Google Chrome, I'll simply paste the link in there. And open the link. And so as you can see here, it's opened the FaceTime call. Now what I need to do here is enter my name. I'm going to enter WebPro as my name and tap on continue. And then it says FaceTime, of course, needs to access your camera and your microphone if it's the first time. So you want to allow that. And then ask to join as that name. So when you tap on join, the person who started the call has to let you in by tapping on this plus icon. And then them themselves, they have to join the call. And that will now be a complete video call. And it's connected just like that. And you can now FaceTime with your Android people from your iPhone or your iPad running iOS 15 or iPadOS 15. Finally, thanks for watching. You can leave your comments and questions down below. Don't forget to share and subscribe for more tips. Until the next one, my name is Chris and I'll talk to you guys soon.